Hi everyone, now we come back again as uh, with the uh, part 4 and this part 4 is uh, we want to talk about how to move your apps into the view component okay? in the view component is uh, to create or in decrease the component to create the HTML and then we can call into the another page okay sometimes when we share component into the component okay so how to move with you component so don't waste time we go to the main js okay so in main js right now we want to create a new component to call into the templates main js okay main js main js so i Okay, and we had the view already, so we add the component. Okay, and component. So we create the component name here. Okay, component. So I create, uh, refer to the portion. Okay, we create the component name, the portion. So, and I want to add. Okay, we add the component. So for example, if in the component we add the template, for example, I create the deal. Yeah. Don't forget when we create the template, you must uh, import the deal to render in the template with the UGS. So we use the deal first, and I add. So I do that. I want we use the slash okay, I want. Let's use my apps. Okay, so how to call the component name into the template in the template main GS? So for example, I use the person, okay. I refer to the complete uh, component name we call with the person so I move we call it like this so when I refresh mean that's my app so here okay and right now we you know the clearly how to create the component so I compose person component when I refresh so we change to the component here, okay, and this is the my apps. I or develop, the developers. Okay, I very fast and hi or developers, you. So right now we move, okay, and we move the filter to use in the component single component. So I move to filter. We add a filter here. Okay, we add a filter and add the method. Or you can use the in the data here, but I use the called the prof. Yes. And props, we call it like this. And prop mean that we uh, return data into the props, and the prop we use the in person component that, that call data from the template uh, person name. Okay, so right now we create the uh, template. I want to move. Okay, we move here. I copy from the template to pass in the template here. Okay, when I refresh the data, this is not so. Okay, so right now when we create the already with the component, we call the data from the main GS here into the person component. Okay, so right now we move to and we use we fall. Like before, please. 
Okay, I use peace in Persian. So when I refresh, okay, and now when we call it like this, mean that this is a not complete. One more, we must define into the brom from here. So we do the okay. I agree else the brom refer to person and the person we call the in the template here okay template here and this is the person refer to the brown person here so we use the we bind okay we use we we bind and right now we want to refer to the we bind in the brown component or uh, brown in the person component piece so we call the piece and right now we call the data from the P object here. Okay, I refresh. Okay, and then we bind and portion to the portion. Okay, and so, oh, okay, sorry, and we don't use the loop here, so I move to and we create the slash and I choose. So we call the full name. Okay, please. And right now I add the full name. So in the filter, we copy the filter here. Okay. We move to the component. I pass the filter. And we move the method here. Okay, into the method. Okay, when I refresh and render to the successfully, and this is the same. And this is that we use the component and to call it to the component. For example, if we want to add one more component, if you want to create the more component we can copy for example I copy or we create the component to add the title here for example I want to change and I move to the new we use the two component so I create the new component rule and we add the component we call the title component okay we create title component and template we create the deal okay. so that's not some deal so right now I copy the view and component here so we pass Okay, we use the A1 slash H1. So I use the B1. When I refresh, so right now we change the we use it for the beginner here. So I replace the okay, and this is the code base not used. So, so I refresh again. Okay, so this we done. Okay, so we move to the main JS again, and right now we want to call the component title here. Oh, okay, component title. We copy. Okay, I copy and I pass the component title. Here. And okay, and this is that we create with the uh, two component for example for you for the beginner to learn with you JS. Okay. okay, if you want to move data into the component to calling data, you can copy for example I copy here, we go to and I move the block here. 
so okay and this is so data that is no display so I copy the we use the ID for example I uh, call the person component like this so right now we add uh, okay and for example we use we and four piece in question so I copy check here I pass so I render and this is the same okay and right now I want to control come back I use the like this okay I use the like this you can choose the uh, multiple way to create the uh, component and to display data okay everyone now I move to the so with the uh, table okay I don't want to use the like this so then I move to the table we create the table here okay now I move to the table I use the text and this is we change to with the table Just the tab bar here. So now I add a T hat. Share the T hat, we add T or Okay, everyone, I don't want to change, so you can try by your set to react. Yes, I don't want to waste time because I am busy. Okay, everyone, and this video I want to complete, and if you like, don't forget to share, like, and comment below on my video. Okay, and I think that and this lesson and uh, with the UGS you can know step by step as uh, for the beginner that you want to learn the UGS. Okay, so right now I say goodbye. Good luck everybody.